what it do crew it is vlogmas day 12 guys yes we making it to 12 we almost pushing it to 25 boo thank us again that's why i told you when you stay ready you gotta get ready once again we pray that you all are enjoying the vlogmas videos thus far if you don't mind go back and check out the vlogmas 2022 playlist boo because if you miss some you need to get caught up before you watch them so go back and watch day one through them and then come back and watch 12. <laughs> All right, guys, let's go over here and see what these elves are up to today. Wow. Baby, I guess they feeling like they gonna cook some, some, some peanut butter cookies, but wow. Why come she wrapped up in itself for a sugar pot? <laughs> All right, guys, make sure that y'all give this video a big thumbs up. Make sure you hit the subscribe button so when you stay ready, you gotta get ready. And make sure that you hit the notification bell so you don't miss Another vlogmas video from us. All right, y'all. Check into the video. Happy Vlogmas Day, baby. Whatever this is. Y'all, I actually cannot believe that I had no footage for this day. I didn't have an intro. I didn't have an outro. The only thing that I discovered is that, baby, I had made some chili cheese dolls and some chili cheese fries. And we was getting it in. So, yeah, guys. I'm going to let y'all just watch me make these chili cheese um, dogs and fries. I had a taste for it. So I was like, you know what? Let me just make this. Not knowing that I ain't recorded nobody vlogs video for this day. I could not believe it when I was getting ready to, you know, line my footage up. Because I try to keep it lined up in chronological order because I do record every day. Even though I kind of try to stockpile my videos and then edit them and then release them as the days go. However, this day shook them. This all I have, y'all. I'm sorry, but I hope this home video make you hungry sugar because I was hungry this day. And um, I used two different kind of chilies that I had. I had one chili I think was from, uh, what is it, Aldi? And I think one was from Wendy's. And I had already browned my meat because I knew earlier that's what I wanted to eat. And I know y'all said, damn, that's all y'all ever eat is ground chuck. My people are simple. That's all they like to eat is either that, turkey, chicken, yeah, that's it, because we don't eat pork. My husband doesn't eat pork at all. So, yeah, I have to make sure that I am, you know, preparing things that he like. And if he say, hey, yeah, I want some chili cheese fried, baby, we make a song. Because we sure not going to Crystal's and pay no 3 to $4 for no handful of french fries. And a scoop of chili on the top. When I can make my own, I even make them better than Sonic, baby, because I put some hot peppers on top of mine. Because Sonic make them, too. The only thing I like about Sonic is they have the nacho cheese on my chili cheese anything give me some shredded cheese don't give me no doggone uh nacho cheese so as you see i felt like i didn't have enough chili in the my meat that i added to it so i added another can because i had to make chili cheese dogs as well as chili cheese fries because i really was just making the chili cheese fries and then here comes my son mama can you make uh hot dogs so i ended up putting my beef hot dogs in the oven because, like I say, we eat beef more so than pork. My husband doesn't eat pork at all. But my kids, well, you know, they go to school, so, hey, they're going to eat whatever comes across the plate in the lunchroom. So, yeah, I just throw my um, hot dogs in the oven. And, yeah, I'm stirring this up, my, my chili, just to ensure that it doesn't stick. And just to give my chili, even out the can, a little kick, I'm going to add my chili season to it. Because just because it came out the can don't mean it tastes good, baby. got to add a little seasoning to that. And I also added a little bit of chili powder just to give it a little bit of kick. Because like I said, you don't want that chili straight out the can, even though you have seasoned your ground beef. If you add ground meat to your chili, like when you make chili cheese dog. I mean, when I make chili cheese dog, number one, I don't want no beans sitting up in there. Or if I wanted some beans sitting up in there, 
I just would have made me a big pot of chili and I would have made some grilled cheese sandwiches and we would have caught it a day. But this particular day, sugar, I just wanted some chili cheese fries and then here come my son with the extra. He won't chili cheese dogs and you know what i don't even think he even <laughs> ate chili on his i think he just stuck with the ketchup and the mustard so next y'all here i come with my handy dandy little trusty dusty little old air fry sugar um i mainly now i kind of shop more so with aldi than anywhere else so i am using some aldi crinkle cut fries my husband is the crinkle cut fry person to me it really don't matter however if i get those big steak fries that I have to be eating them with something not like chili because to me the steak fries are much too big in order to you know have chili cheese fries with so I went ahead and sprayed my little handy dandy little old air fry sugar and I'm going to drop enough fries in you know for everybody to eat I think my daughter ended up eating some fries but she didn't eat hers with the chili she just ate her fries regularly so I popped those in the air fryer at 350 for about 15 minutes till they get golden golden brown they damn near got a little bit too brown, y'all see when they come, but I let those go for 15 minutes so they can get golden brown. And then after they get golden brown, baby, I spread them sugars out on the plate. I put that chili on the top, I put that cheese on the top, and I put me some hot peppers. And it be on like popcorn. You hear me? You hear me? Do you understand what I'm saying? So yeah, I am getting my little hot dogs out. Y'all can see I like my stuff well done. I am a well done meat type of girl. I don't want to cut in no meat and it's pink on the inside. Do you hear me? Because pink meat will tear your stomach up. You will have the BGs for days. So here is my plate, y'all. It might look not good to y'all, but it was good to my stomach. It was good to my mouth. 